Hey, and welcome back to the DDPR MR2 squared project. It is evening of day 19 and uh, a lot has been going on here. So I'm going to try to bring you up to speed on what's been happening. So I don't have a ported cylinder head to show you today because they are actually done and both heads and the full valve trains are at the machine shop. Uh, we are doing stainless steel valves for the uh, uh, intake and then we're doing in canal for the exhaust, uh, upgraded springs, retainers as well and then uh, brand new guides, and of course the heads have been fully ported and the chambers are polished. Uh, this right here you can see is a uh, is our 2GR block. Um, now if you notice, it's got some sleeves in here. These are Darton MID sleeves, and MID stands for Modular Integrated Deck. And what that means is that the uh, it's not just a sleeve, but you can see this outer portion, the outer support, is actually one piece with the, uh, with the sleeve as well. That's to give a little extra strength and stability at the very top of the uh, combustion chambers. So that's where the greatest pressure is, is when the piston's at top dead center and you have your combustion event, the greatest pressure is in that top area, so that helps reinforce the uh, upper area of that sleeve and keep it from walking. So, really cool technology from uh, Darton there. Uh, we also have here some uh, H-beam billet rods. These are from uh, Monkey Wrench Racing. Uh, you can see they're uh, real nice billet H-beam design. They should be good for however much power we choose to go through here. They do have the uh, ARP uh, 2000 bolts on there. So. That's cool. Uh, moving on to the car, we have some cool stuff going on in the interior here. Now, if you remember last time we had that one hoop, uh, we now have both hoops done. Uh, we do have the uh, interior uh, support brace built inside of each hoop, and we even have a little uh, bracing done between the hoops, and uh, what you see behind the hoops here is the starting of our harness bar. Uh, so it's uh, the car will probably see a couple of motorsports events. It typically won't be driving around with harnesses on the street, but uh, you know, if we do take it to a couple of drag days or, uh, you know, a track day or something like that, we will have uh, probably a four-point harness available. So that's the uh, that's the new harness bar there. Of course, it is uh, DUM steel tubing, uh, which is the same stuff we use to make proper roll cages out of. And then around the back, uh, the turbo system is essentially unchanged, but uh, we do have uh, the intake manifold is back together. So we have a pretty cool series of pictures of that that are going to be available on the photo album on our uh, Facebook page if you check it out. But it was cut, sectioned, uh, the pieces have been welded back together, and we've begun blending on the plenum. Now we still obviously have quite a bit of work to go as far as polishing, and then we're actually going to enlarge the uh, holes down there at the side, and then uh, refinish everything to look real nice. But, uh, but it is now the correct interior size, and uh, it is the correct length, and we are working on the CAD drawings for the lower plenum. And now we're gonna squeeze up here. There's one last thing to look at at the front which is just a new part that came in. Uh, we did a bunch of exhaust mock-up the other day and we're really tight for space because of how far the engine and turbo come back. Um, so we have purchased a new burn stainless muffler. It's considerably smaller than the original Vibrant muffler we were planning on using. Um, we just had to do that for the available space that's in there. Uh, you can also see, uh, we're probably not gonna use this one, but we do have uh, a cutout for one of those uh, QRP, uh, uh, or QTP, sorry, uh, the exhaust cutouts, electronic exhaust cutout. There will be one of those on the car, which will bypass the cat and the uh, muffler and resonator. All right, so that's it. Thanks for uh, joining us for day uh, 19 update here at the DDPR MR2 squared project. Hope you have a great weekend.